About 300 people, including Fresno State students, rallied and marched in downtown Fresno on May Day, calling on Congress to reform immigration law. A lot of the students that I've worked with and a lot of the allies and friends that I've become friends with um, are undocumented and have benefited from DACA and DAPA, but I've seen through those experiences and experiences that people have shared with me that um, it's not enough. The protest in Courthouse Park was organized by the May 1st Coalition for Immigrant Rights with help from seven other nonprofit and grassroots organizations. Fresno State alumnus Walter Ramirez, who represents the local Salvadorian community, says he was pleased with the turnout. We hope that more communities come together when it comes to advocating for people's rights, especially here in the Central Valley. There's a big population of, of families uh, that uh, are in need for, for their uh, rights to be acknowledged. The crowd chanted, sang, and waved signs in English and Spanish as it made its way through more than a dozen blocks and past City Hall. People did not only rally and protest, they were also given information and encouraged to register to vote. 11 million undocumented people are living in the U.S. Similar protests were held nationwide. The March in Fresno has been held annually since 2006, when more than 10,000 people rallied in downtown demanding immigration reform. Organizers say although the number of protesters was not that high on Friday, they remain optimistic. The people who came here came with that spirit, you know, to continue fighting. Uh, the march and the rally is only uh, a point to start uh, uh, the whole year to work on many issues. Speakers in Friday's protest also supported expanding DACA and DAPA, which halt deportations for eligible individuals. Both executive orders are stalled in federal court. Elsa Mejia, Fresno State Focus.